If you are looking for a comfortable and quality streetwear style, without doubt, the answer to your question is Gap. Indeed, Gap has always been known to follow the casual cool trends and make an improbable basic clothing turn quite appealing. Gap especially took off by Ori Lazin in 1993, an ad featuring many celebrities at the time, like Steve McQueen or Miles Davis. Moreover, when Sharon Stone wore a Gap scarf with her fashion Armani dress at the Oscars, it took Gap to another level and established it as an iconic brand. By 2001, Gap attained the nearly 14 billion of sales. So, what made this top brand feeling afterwards and struggling to re-establish itself in the market? There are different reasons explaining this failure. Firstly, Gap simply lost its coolness. The brand failed to provide in what customers really want. They did not stay updated with the new trends initiated by pop stars as Britney Spears with her cropped up and low right pants. Instead, they were always offering their same long-lasting hoodies in different colors. The second reason was that the board managers at Gap were quitting, and as replacers, former executives of Disney and Canadian drugstores were the new boardroom. Unfortunately, they failed at understanding the marketing spirit of the brand instead of working on design and creative departments for giving back the cool attitude of Gap, they tried to implement cost-cutting strategies, which did not work well with the Gap and sales continued to drop out. Today, Gap is still failing at regaining its coolness, possession of the trendy and cool streetwear it used to occupy. The market has too much competition from all kinds. The fast fashion giant retailers such as H&M are the new big players of trendy clothing. They constantly drop new collections driven by the fashion on social media and with a good perceived quality price deals. Hence, the new CEO of Gap stated in an interview that they were currently working on repositioning their strategic focus on operating structures to make a memorable comeback to their customers. Thank you everyone, I wish you liked the video and see you on the next one.